Hello everyone, my name is Edith Mukawusha and today we are going to talk about data sharing with ActuEIS Pro. So after analyzing your data and creating your maps and projects and you want to share them and make them accessible to other users, you can share them as layer packages or map packages or even as a web map. So we are going to see how to do that and we shall start by sharing as a map package. So when you want to do that, you go to that share tab in the packages group you select map it will give a window that will ask you do you want to start packaging to an online account or do you want to package to a file so we shall select the default to an online account so let's give it a name sharing map package so after that let's give a simple summary this is all about sharing data it's all about data sharing so we can put some tags to help our map is to be accessed by other users data sharing then map package so thereafter we can now select where we want to save our map package i'll put it in my folder so do we want to share it with everyone or just the organization or just a group in the organization i'll select a group that i had already created earlier it's sharing data with actuals pro now i click analyze my map package analyzing helps me to check for any errors and warnings that could be in the map and if there's none i package but i, I had no none so i package but in case i had some i would have to resolve them before i package so as it packages i'll i'll tell you the difference between sharing to an online account and sharing to a uh, packaging to a file <clears throat> so when you're sharing to an online account your map is actually shared to an online account and only those users who have access to your group on the online account will be able to access it but when you share it and package it to a file it will still be saved on your computer and when you want to share it with other users you just have to get a flash and copy and paste it on your flash and share with other users so now let's try to check for our map that we just shared and see what other users will be seeing when they're accessing it so you go to the portal since we share to the online account and then you go in your group sharing data then you will see the map that you just packaged so you open it to see let's compare and see if the symbology and all the layers will appear the way they were in the original map that we shared so the map has opened you can see all the layers are there in the contents pane and now let's check for the symbology yeah it's also the same which means it's good and we shared well so let's try another method of sharing which is sharing as a layer package so when you're sharing as a layer package, make sure you select all the layers that you want to share with other users. Select them in the contents pane and then you go back to the share tab in the package package group. Now you select the layer tab. Let's This time let's choose the second option of save package to file. Click on it and then after clicking on it, you will see that they were, this time around they've already selected for you the, the location where it is saved so you have to master the location in case you want to be able to access your package yeah so then <coughs> we shall go and add a simple summary this is all about data sharing so we add some tags i'll call it a layer package and i'll add another tag of data sharing so now you see this time they've not asked you which folder or location because we've already selected the location on the desktop now we shall just package and if there are no errors and no warnings we shall move on to packaging so when you want to access a layer package that has been saved to a file you go to its location and you share it via flash unlike the one that's shared on an online account because for it it's accessed through the portal so now let's try to share in another way which is sharing as a web map so when you're sharing as a web map you go to the tab web map and they display for you a window we shall give it a name we shall erase the map and then put web map so let's add a simple 
I'll add my initials to make it unique. So let's add a simple summary. This is all about data sharing. So I'll add the tags again. Oops. So I'll add the tags web map. And data sharing. So now it will ask me where do I want to save my map. I'll select my folder still. And then I want to share it to a certain group, which is data sharing that JS Pro. Then I analyze again. Oops, this time around we have some errors that we shall need to resolve before we move on to packaging. Sharing. So you can see the errors. And now if you want to first expand and you click on the three dots. Then we select in the contents pane to help us know which layer, which layer exactly has an issue. We can see it's west and the second one is north. So we are going to have to correct these errors, these errors before we move on. So we shall still move on to the layers, right click, go to properties. And since it was saying that they have the same ID, we shall have to change this layer ID to a unique number. So let's give it seven. Okay. And then let's also go and do the same for waste. Right click properties. Since we've already changed the one of north, we can leave the one of, of waste. So now they are both unique. So they are telling us that the shape length cannot be. So we right click and then go to display. display and then you make sure you change the to name yes so you do that for all of the other layers change to name right click properties and you change the display to name So that's okay. Now let's try analyzing again to see if we still have any errors left. Oops, we have one more shape length to not be. So we shall click the three dots and then you open the symbology package and you change the shape length to name. Yeah. So now we can save and analyze again. Yep, there are no errors, no warnings. So now we can share our web map. Click on the share button. Oh, I will tell you the difference between sharing as a web map and as a package. When you share as a web map, the whole map and its data source are shared to the portal as we are going to see. So let's check to see what other users will be able to see when they're accessing our web map. Click, right click, add and open. <clears throat> So you see all the layers and symbology has not been altered. That means we've shared well and other users will be able to access it well. So let's try to see the data source. Right click properties and then gen source. No, use the information, right click properties. Source, so you can see that the source is now actually a URL, which means that our map has been shared to the cloud and it is now accessed on the cloud everything but for the when you're sharing as a package you will see its source is still on the computer thank you